My name is Atiba Kwesi, and I'm an outreach worker for Ceasefire, a program that comes out of Temple University in Philadelphia. And what we do is we go into the community, and particularly in the 22nd Police Precinct in that district. And we work with what they call the worst of the worst, um, those who are out there. Um, they say that they can't be helped. We go out there and we try to work with them to reduce the violence and the killing. Um, give you an example of what we have to work with. Um, this is 2011, and this year, the 4th of July weekend, from Friday to Sunday, there were 32 shootings in this city. Um, the evening when, I, when, when that stat came out, I went to the website because I was very curious, and I went around the world to some of the, what they call the hot spots, Belfast, and um, over in the Middle East. And I wanted to find out, had there been that many shootings anywhere else? And remember, this is not supposed to be a, a war zone, but in some of the places in, in the world where they consider war zones, they didn't have 13 shootings in that amount of time. I mean, 32 shootings in that amount of time. So you know, it, it really brought home to me what we're up against. Now, all of those shootings were in our target area, but 10 of them were. And for there to be 32 shootings in a little less than 72 hours in any city, what they call in the civilized, what they call the civilized country, was amazing to me. And for it to be in my hometown was a rude awakening to the amount of work that needs to be done and how we really need to have some true leaders in our community. We're not talking about politicians, we're talking about leaders.